So let's solder this guy on here, 0603 SMT resistor. Put a blob of solder on the pad first, like so. Get a nice one, a nice round ball, nice and shiny. Grab the part, drop it on the board in about the right spot. Sometimes you get some tweezer stickage like this. You can just wipe off those tweezers on your soldering sponge. Not a big deal because the solder will hold it in place. Get that guy ready, flat on the board. Bring your iron back in. Melt the ball of solder and then slide the part in. Get it right in place. And as soon as it's in place, you can pull the iron away. Give it a chance to solidify and then pull your tweezers away. Okay, you can very gently tap on it to make sure it's tacked down. That looks good. If you wanted to move it, now is the time but this looks nice and straight. So we're gonna bring our iron back to the other side. Try and heat up the pad and the part. Dab some solder in there. Gonna to kinda of touch the pad, the part, and the iron just to get her flowing, like so. You can see actually the resistor will heat through in some cases, so you gotta be a bit careful on that. Don't pull away too fast. You can go and just add a bit more to each side, make sure you have good joints there. Every time you add solder, you're adding flex and that helps things flow. Once you have a good connection, you can wipe off these little extra bits of solder just with a motion like that, with a clean iron tip, and then you have a good joint.